need you to jump, please. Thank you. Grab that. We already got the spirit that's up here. And now that we have these, we can grab you. Oh, no. There we go. Some more Furious Blight. And this room has become yellow on our map, so we're good. All right, we're here on Robarton Domain. There's a lot of relics and stuff around here. So, well, there's, there's a few relics. There's some beads of sorcery, or chains of sorcery, excuse me. Ah, gosh dang it. And there's a few, like, items that we didn't grab. I'm trying to check a couple things. There we go. Amulet fragment here. That doesn't clear out this room. So there's another... I wasn't looking... I was not paying attention. You know what? I definitely did not go this way. I genuinely thought I did for a bit, though. Okay. Pop a heal real quick. I probably could have let my health get lower. Okay, so that's collected already. That's what the chain of sorcery was. I'm over here just, like, trying to remember stuff off the ow cuff. Do not see you. Oh no, this is the chain of sorcery. Okay, I was just in the wrong location. So yeah, chain of sorcery there under that guy. Uh, this is, room's not done though. So I have to keep going just a wee bit. I think it might be the next level down. Ah! So this is only our second time using that ability. But as you can see, it's nice, it opens those doors. So here's the weird, because this one's super creepy. A lot of the enemies we fought, when we've purified them, they've still been like, thank you, or please, you shouldn't have been here. That one's just maniacally laughing. Despite being blighted in battle, driven by some purpose, this former knight was able to cling to his humanity. Escaping the stockade, he headed to the verboten quarters and entered Faden's lab. Uh, Pen, I don't, I'm wondering what you mean by able to uh, maintain some of his uh, humanity, but it is what it is to each their own. I guess we will disagree on what that means. Gosh dang it. Let's 
kill here. And I need to actually... I'm gonna, I'm gonna go this way first. We're gonna stop off in sub-lab 2. Because we're missing something from here. But it's right here, isn't it? Yep. Let's go. And take a seat. So here, I'm gonna take a moment. Let's see how much enhancing we can do. Where's cigarette at? I can enhance cigarette, and to get it to our last level up, it's gonna take a lot. Can't quite get our ancient souls max yet. That will come in due time. All right, this room. We need to drop down to the very bottom here. See, even though this water sucks, having the mask, I don't care that much, so long as I'm not in it for too long. So I need to go underwater down here, I believe. I believe it's underwater in the bottom right. And I believe there's underwater on the bottom left, there's one as well. How? Rude much? Some Furious Blight. Good. Got what I wanted. Which one does this take me to? Center. Uh, there is something in this room, I believe. There's a couple things in here. This room's really weird to like, traverse because... You can only get to the right side from this room, and you can only get to the left side from that other room. Amulet Fragment. I do believe this is the only thing that's found on this side, though. So, we'll take that. The other stuff is going to be on the other side, so we'll worry about that later. But good. Either. Okay, we're going to come up to this room. There should be two objects in this room. I don't remember if I've gotten either of them, because unfortunately, I don't, ex unless I know explicitly what I'm going after, I don't really explore around in a verboten domain. Okay, I definitely didn't get this one. Good item. Okay. Let me see if I can get up to that top left area. <sighs> oh, wait, that ceiling is slanted in the worst way. There we go. That's, that's a weird jump. That's not that bad, but definitely a weird one. Um, let's do this. We have this amulet frag fragment. Wow, I got out of there alive. That's something that probably shouldn't have happened. And now I die. It's okay. Climb all the way up to the top. So the issue is, you'd have to go over here and realize this is there. But in the moment, you're never going to think to come into this little alcove over here. Because you're in such a rush, you're just trying to get out. 
Honestly, clever placement, but rude placement to deal with. Okay. Alright, so now I actually need to go under the water. Grab that stagnant blight. There's more out. There's more things underwater, though. Amulet gem. And this should be another thing of blight. Okay, this room's done. And truthfully speaking, here is the main thing that I came here to get. That we're actually probably just gonna hold an L. Or actually, I might not even need to hold the L. I might be able to get to a sub lab. Dang. Almost. It's fine. I'll just jump to sub lab four. Okay. This is a bit of a tough area. And what I actually want to do is I want to take a moment and unlock the basement sub lab four there I can't believe I never unlocked this it's crazy I swear I did but it's fine because this is where I want to be The Verboten Domain, a dangerous place, no doubt corrupted by the Blight, that once served as home to the ancient sorcerers. If we can learn more about the ancient magic responsible for the Blight's origin, I'm sure it will help the White Priestesses. It may even lead to a world devoid of the Blight affliction. Okay. Ow. Double ow. So this is the incompetent center. There. This is a very easy spirit to miss if you don't know it's there. Center a center sealed in the subterranean lab. Once a curious and bold man, he ventured into the blighted and forbidden Vorboten domain. His blighted form was found some time later, nonviolent and lucid. So, this is a very important spirit for some of the tasks we have coming up. I actually, this is the reason, this is the entire reason why I wanted to take a moment and go do Vorboten Domain. I'll be honest, I don't want to be here. I don't even want to finish this area. I just wanted to get the Incompetence uh, Center. Because this makes some of those platforming segments somewhere between doable and not that difficult. We're going to finish these couple rooms off real quick though because I'm here already. There's one thing left in this room I believe. And then we'll go up and ca and cap off the other couple rooms near here. Ow! Oh. oh, it reached that far, my dude. You're off screen. Huh? We lived. That's what matters most. Oh, is it dead? Yay! It's dead. Okay, we need to get up to the top left side of this room. Once we get up there, 
there's some items that we can get our hands on. Or by some items, I mean an item. The worst part is I know I came through here and I probably went right past it at some point. There we go. As we use our... God, it's so easy just to use your sword attacks to like just hover a little bit. Oh, I didn't see that one. Jesus. That. Good. It's one of the things I came here for. And now, um, yeah, I don't know if I can deal with any of these enemies in this state. I just have too low of HP, or I guess I don't have heals. There, right at the top of this room. Cool. For what I care about, Robot and Domain is done. We're gonna, we are gonna come back to here later, but it's essentially done. 